teams talk to us about Mark and uh, humiliating result. I don't know if it's humiliating, Pete, but I understand it's disappointing. Um, they've, they've got some good players. It was their day today. They've, they've um, done a decent job on us. First half, we were too many of us not not doing as well as we should have done and uh, that, that was the downfall of our, our game today second half we threw everything at them we had chance after chance after chance we were always going to leave ourselves a little bit open at the end of it which you know we did but sometimes it's, it's a massively disappointing we wanted to come here and, and put in a good performance and a good win today but um, unfortunately we We've, we've fallen victim to that, you know, that FA Cup thing that where you know teams from a lower league can beat anybody. Did you think you could have had a penalty in the last minute? I've just seen it. I, it's a definite penalty. But listen, credit to Tamworth. You know they've uh, they've they've probably earned that little bit of a bit of luck at the end. But but yeah, it was, it was a, I've just seen it, it was a stonewall penalty. How do you count for the first half? Because you were much better second half. But yeah, the first half you were a bit bullied, weren't you? I thought my two centre centre-halves were bullied. I thought my front two were not involved in the game. Um, and, and you know we told them about we, you know we warned about them, showed them set pieces about how you know big and strong they are and, and, how, and how awkward they can make it for you. And we, one one average ball into our box and, and we've conceded a goal that we should never have conceded. But, um, Disappointed. That was that was massively disappointing. You made changes at the, at the start. And one of those was a decision to put CBD at right back. What, what was the thinking behind that? He can play both sides. Craig, he gives you energy, and I just felt it was the right thing to do with without David Noble in the team. And we wanted to try and get three strikers on the pitch. Um, you know, so we've learned we've learned something of sure, but. I've got a squad of players that I'm more than happy to pick from and um, today we let ourselves down in the first half in particular. And then half time you made a decision to change it, what was the thinking behind Russ Penn being the man you could have? Uh, it could have been a couple but I just wanted to, I just felt we needed Craig on the left, I think we needed Stevie's experience and to be able to do with their two centre half, centre four was better than we had. Um, it just meant we just rejigged it a little bit and tried to get Sammy in more advanced positions. I thought we, we got into some, we had seven or eight really good chances where we've not, we've not pulled the trigger or, or, or it's, we've not had the desire that the ball finishes in the back of the net. You know, we've got some great positions. Um, Cooper's pulled a couple of saves off, but we've not been ruthless enough. And it's, it is massively disappointing. And the fans, as you can imagine, tonight are pretty unhappy. You can understand. Yeah, I'm, I, I am. I am. You know, we came here to, to get through to the next round. We came here to work harder than them to, to be as competitive as them and, and, and the competitive side of it we didn't we didn't stand up to in the first half and uh, we, were, we then gave them something to hang on to something to keep hold of and, and we chucked every day but we just we didn't we didn't have enough today and, and to get that equaliser and, and go on and win it in the first minute of the second half we get a corner the ball's bounced on the line from the keeper's hands and we've we had a, someone had a chance just to stick their head through it from a yard might have got a kick in the face, but that's what it's about sometimes. Getting a boot in the face, but balls in the back of the net, it's game on again. Um, and we didn't have, we've got to look at ourselves and ask if we had enough desire out there today. And that must be massively disappointing. That's, that's massively, yeah. You know, we, we, we plug one leak, we just, we've just been talking and stuff in there. We, we get one thing, we sort one thing out and something else happens at the minute with this group. So, listen, it's back to work on, on the training ground on Monday to, to go again. You know, we, it's, it's, it's massively disappointing. I understand that for the chairman, for the fans, for everybody connected with the football club, my staff more than anybody else are massively disappointed. And my players, players are too. So, you know, we have to pick ourselves up. We will do, but we, but we need a long, hard look at ourselves now. Does it leave you questioning yourself, Mike? No, not at all. Are you questioning me, Pete? I, I'm asking, you're, you're my manager, you're questioning the players' design, I'm asking... I'm asking I, I thought the design in the first half wasn't as good as theirs, and that's why they scored and we, and we, and we conceded. I have no, no doubt whatsoever about my ability, and um, I don't think that's in question. So, Monday, back on the training ground and lift the players? Without a shadow of a doubt, we have to.
But you know, we're not kidding ourselves that you know, we're in a good place right now. But there's not a great deal wrong. But we've got to just tweak one or two things, work on one or two things, and just instill just a little bit more desire when it matters. You can't give it players, but you can you can demand more and more of them. And, and, and you mentioned earlier, you said with this group of players, it's, it's sort of one thing and then it's another thing. Um, what, what can you do about that? Because you're coming well, out here, you must be frustrated every time coming and talking. Yeah, of course, same I, old thing. of course, of course. You have to persevere, and, and eventually the penny will drop with with the ones, and you'll and we'll get the right, we'll pick the right team. I, I, I felt like I picked my best team today, um, but we, I say, we've come up short, which is obviously massively disappointing, but. Yeah, we've got to go again next week. Cheers, Pete. Mark, you say you're not doubting your ability at all, but is this the, the most testing time you've had as a manager, do you think? Then? I think the season I came here was the most testing. When you know, when we were we hadn't got good players at the club, we hadn't got anything. The we're nine points off. Yeah, of course it's John, but not none more so than from me. You know, the supporters uh, saw the effort they put in first half, but like me, was must, must have been pulling their hair out why it didn't happen first half. Um, we, we, we told them before the game that well, they said themselves, the players, they don't want to be on the end of, a, of an upset. And we we did everything we did the preparation to make sure that was, was going to be the case. And um, like I said, unfortunately, when it when I crossed the line at the start at three o'clock, we can't be out there making the decisions for them. We got, we got bullied in a couple of areas and and conceded, you know, a, a poor goal. Yeah, easy to criticise after a game, but what do you think you've learned from the first half? You know, what, what was particularly disappointed yeah. with about that first half performance? Just the way their two centre forwards were able to just dominate us. Um, the movement of my, 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 my front three. Um, it wasn't good enough at both ends of the pitches, and, and that's why we went in 1-0 down. We were a hell of a lot better second half. Um, we, had, we had that desire that we needed, but not not quite enough to to ram the ball home in certain situations. You know, you know Jamie's had two great chances as well. You know, we, 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 I know they broke on us a couple of times right at the end. But, but we've had we could easily be talking about something different. Don't get me wrong. I'm not I'm not stupid enough to think. You know, the harsh reality. You know, we've had a couple of really, really, really good chances today that we could easily, you know, have, 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 have got back level and, and gone on to win the game. We haven't. That's that's football. That's life. And I say. We have to pick ourselves up and go again next week. Yeah, the last two years obviously been great times in the FA Cup, but you've not really been able to kick on. It's almost like the season's peaked with the FA Cup third round, isn't it? Well, and, but well that certainly can't be happening this yeah, year, so John. It's going to be and different. We got to, we're doing everything the wrong, the, the the opposite way around this year. You know, we, we didn't get through to the Carling Cup next round, and we've done that. We, we've always made good starts. The last couple of years, we haven't done that this year. But like I said we're nine points off second in the table, um, and. Still, all to play for. You know, we've had cup, good cup runs, and we know how beneficial they can be. We we haven't had that this year now, and uh, I'm sure the chairman will be disappointed, like like I am, and the board will be. But sometimes, just things go against you, and you have to you have to deal with it. Yeah, you've got Steve Elliott back from injury, and after a little rest, and Jermaine McGlash is not far away. You've got David Noble back next week yeah. as well. Do you, do you think you know your best team at the moment? Um, how to fit everyone into the best yeah, well, positions? We'll, we'll we'll keep looking to and keep finding. You know, in our, our league form, we're not too bad over the last month and three games unbeaten. Um, but we've got to start stop talking about it and you know put those performances into results and, and on a regular basis now. Yeah, have you thought about doing anything drastic with the, the squad no, in no, terms of getting think, players out? I don't. I'll, I don't know. I might have to do a little bit of wheeling dealing. Um, just see what comes in the next couple of days. Yeah. All right. Cheers, All right. Yeah. Thank Cheers. You.